three of the Eastern quarterfinals, the four seed, the Chicago Bulls, and the five seed, the Washington Wizards. As night seven of the 2014 NBA playoffs continue, and for the last six years, this has been a foreign scene. It is the NBA playoffs in your nation's capital. Welcome inside the Verizon Center, and welcome back to the playoffs, Washington. The defense of Washington, very underrated. They do an excellent job. This move to the basket by Dunley, they got knocked down at the end. And then they have the perimeter dunk for their two big men, which is rare. Erling Dunleavy got hit, knocked down again, but scores. Heel off on the shot, Dunleavy take away, a rare run out. Butler with the finish, and the Bulls lead 8 7. Offensive foul right there by Hammer. Great pass by Nay. Dunleavy knocks down the three, and it is. Uh, Nene is averaging 20 points in his series, shooting 63%. Dunleavy again, yeah. filling it up here in the first quarter. Mike Dunleavy has 10. After averaging 10 in the first two games of the series. And I like it, Mike, because this is the Bulls' defense. And Washington with 24, so three minutes to go in the first. Good yeah, attack yeah. by Boozer over Gortat. 34 to 9 in game three. Memphis bench is playing great. John Levy out of the timeout, knocks down the three, leading all scores. You know, you, you got a guy in foul trouble. You know he's their best defender, and you want to take him out of this. The three knocked down by DJ Augustine. They've answered both Washington runs here. In this half, it's shot fake by Dunleavy right to the oh, cup pretty. and one. Mike Dunleavy gives the Bulls the lead. Now that that was a great move by Dunleavy as he dips his. Levy finds his open teammate. Boozer missed it. Dunleavy keeping it alive oh, and it goes boy. in. There's a miraculous tap. Dunleavy curling, feeling it. Mike oh, Dunleavy wow. keeping the Bulls in the game. Dunleavy on the curve. Knocks it down the chance for the four-point play, and the Bulls can retake the lead. Let me tell you something. He's, he's made three of these coming from the left corner, and, and as he's coming, he's catching the ball. And important here with Beal on the bench with four. Ariza trying to deny Dunleavy. Good nice. feed inside the Boozer. Dunleavy trying to lose Ariza on that double, gets to the line, and knocks down another three. 29 for Dunleavy tonight. There's been so much conversation with the Bulls about the fourth quarter rotation. Dunleavy's hot. Do you keep playing him? He starts the oh. quarter, and he continues. No. 32 for Dunleavy tonight by Webster. Hit ahead, Nene. To the basket. Timeout, Chicago. I say they need to die. Look out, look out, Nene and Butler. Butting heads, looking at each other. Nene loading up to throw a punch there. Noah gets in the way. They had collided, and like two Brahma Bulls, they had their heads forehead to forehead. And now you got to be careful to see if players came from off the bench area, because I'm looking here. I mean, there are only, let's see, one, two, three, five Bulls out there. So there are five Wizards. Well, here you got to see the play. Now watch Butler here at the back end as Nene yeah. gives him a little chicken wing. Butler the yeah. head back and look at this. Oh, oh yeah. Sure. And now watch here is it Jason Phillips. I give yeah. him credit for getting in there. Nene grabbed the back of Butler's neck, wouldn't let him go anywhere, and they will certainly well, look at this all, replay. Nene gives the hit yes. first. It looked like a few players may have been running from the bench into the altercation, which is an automatic suspension for the next game. That did not happen. So Nene is gone. Butler takes a three, knocks it down, and the Bulls take a five-point lead. All five Washington starters in double figures. Good and going to come in the game here for the Wizards. They can't go back into the corner. Noah from the outside oh. knocks it down. <laughs> Limited confidence with the shot. He's been poor at the free throw line. Only one other field goal, but Noah in this run. Beal has 21. Dunleavy a three. Got it! Oh, my. But this is one of the most difficult areas to inbound the ball to get a good look off of, off of a play. Dunleavy gets it to Noah. Butler has it. He'll take the three and hit. Jimmy Butler gives Chicago the lead. 24 to go. Is that the guy who's missed his first seven threes in this series? Yes, it is. He's made two big ones in this second half. 24-year-old Jimmy Butler. To be recovered by Chicago. 
Butler makes the second. Washington down three will advance it. Inbounded by the Bulls, and it is over. It deserves to be in the hands of Mike Dunleavy for the best night he's ever had in the NBA. 35 points. One shot of his all-time best, but not under pressure in a situation like this. And the Chicago Bulls, did you think they'd just lay down?